purifier operation involves the three-phase separation of oil, water and sludge. Purifiers have a discharge outlet allowing the continuous discharge of separated water. Prior to passing oil through the purifier, sealing water must be provided to ensure that oil does not flow out to the separated water outlet. The separation boundary surface must be set in a reasonable range to ensure proper operation. This is achieved by changing the internal diameter of the gravity disk. Oil enters into the oil inlet and is introduced into the disk via the distributor. The separated water and sludge are forced to the periphery of the bowl. The purified oil moves inside between the disks and is discharged from the light liquid impeller. The separated water passing outside of the top disk overflows from the gravity disk and is discharged from the heavy liquid impeller. Sludge and separated water are then discharged from the outlet to complete the cycle. Let's have a close look at the purification process. When the bowl reaches the rated speed, the centrifugal force that acts upon the pilot valve seals the valve seat and the valve closure water pressure chamber becomes filled with valve closure operating water. The operating water in the valve closure water pressure chamber pushes up the main cylinder using pressure generated by centrifugal force to close the discharge hole. Displacement water is supplied from the dirty oil inlet. Fire.